policy. The Democrats are terrible on policy, but they're very vicious and they're smart and they stick together. They don't have Mitt Romney's and little Ben Sasses and Bill Cassidy. How about Bill Cassidy? He campaigns in the great state of Louisiana. He campaigns that he's Trump's friend. Every ad has Trump in it. Trump, 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 Trump. And then he votes to impeach me. I, I mean, can you believe it? But I always sort of felt that about that guy. Lightweight. But you have another very good senator there. John Kennedy. He's very good. Very good senator. And Bill Cassidy can't walk down the streets of Louisiana without having nasty things said to him. And they don't have anyone, the Democrats, like the warmonger and most quoted Republican in the history of our country by Democrats, Liz Cheney. She's quoted all the time. Every time a Democrat gets up to make a speech, you know this, fellas, right? You have to live with her, I guess. Maybe not much longer. But every time they get up to make a speech, and to quote Liz Cheney, Democrats are ruthless, but they are united. They don't have these Romney types. They don't have them. It must be wonderful to live like that. But they have bad policy, and they have policy that's going to destroy our country. Like socialist and communist movements throughout history, today's leftists do not believe in freedom. They do not believe in fairness, and they do not believe in democracy. They believe in Marxist morality. Anything is justified as long as it hurts their political opponents and advances the radical agenda of their party. It's a radical agenda like nobody has seen before. Before our very eyes, the radical left Democrats are turning the law itself into a weapon for partisan Persecution. It's persecution. It's really party. Look at what they're doing to incredible people like Rudy Giuliani. I mean, he's an incredible, greatest mayor in the history of the city of New York. Great crime fighter. <laughs>